Wagwan, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm showing you how I fry dumpling using instant yeast. I'm using all-purpose flour and for those who believe that all-purpose flour is called plain flour in Jamaica, it is not plain flour, it's counter flour. This is all-purpose, two different types of flour, right? I am using all-purpose flour for this recipe. So I am using two cups of all-purpose flour. quarter teaspoon of instant yeast one teaspoon of sugar and normally I don't put sugar in my fried dumplings but in this recipe because I'm using yeast I must use sugar because the yeast needs the sugar to activate I am also using half teaspoon of salt and if you notice I did not put the salt where the yeast is because salt affects um, the yeast it makes it stop it, it makes it won't rise the flour properly okay so I am now kneading the flour into a dough using lukewarm water the water should not be hot it should be lukewarm So now I am going to cover the dough and allow it to rise for 30 minutes. So I'm going to cover it for 30 minutes. So after 30 minutes, punch down on the dough or just squeeze the dough to deflate it. And then as you can see, the dough is sticky, but everything is okay. You know, just need it for a further two to three minutes. And then I am gonna dust it lightly with some flour to get rid of the stickiness. Yeah, and then the dough is ready to fry.
at this point my husband took over because I really wanted to sleep at that time because I did 16 hours at work maintenance department is no joke anyway all he did was to put a pot on medium low eat mostly on low than medium and then pour in some vegetable oil and allow it to hot and then he pinch off a piece of the dough and then roll it in the shape of a ball and then flatten the ball shape in the palm of his and or he, he used the heel of his hand or the side of his hand to flatten the um the the dough because i don't like my dumplings when they are left in the shape of a ball it takes a lot of oil to fry them like that i don't like them like that so i always flatten mine and i do not like golden brown fried dumplings because those dumplings are over fried I mean you have to over fry them in in order to get them golden brown right I don't eat over fried dumplings no disrespect to those who like their dumplings like that but I don't you understand yeah man so just fry the dumplings for like I would say for like four or five minutes you know these are yeast dumplings they are much easier to fry than when you use the baking powder and I rather yeast fried dumplings my yeast fried dumplings are always soft and fluffy that's the thing that I like about them really really like about them yeah man so nice so fluffy so you can try this recipe to see whether you like the traditional way of frying dumpling by using baking powder or if you prefer using yeast So when you subscribe to my channel, remember to click the post notification bell so that you will know when I uploaded videos to this channel. Thanks for watching.